Hi, welcome to In and Around Computer. In this video, we are going to see the types of computer software. Software generally can be classified into two types. They are application software and the system software. Application software is developed to meet specific needs and perform designated tasks in a computer. And uh, system software is uh, crafted to manage a computer's hardware components and establish a foundation upon which the applications can operate. So this is the difference between the system software and the application software and in this video we are going to see the specific types of the uh, software we can see them on first one is the operating system software and uh, this is a system software that uh, manages the hardware resources and provides a user interface it is uh, the foundation on which other software runs and the examples of Microsoft Windows Mac OS Linux Android iOS and that here the applications are uh, windows provides a user friendly interface that is uh, uh, that is windows operating system and software provides a user friendly interface while the linux os uh, software is for server applications due to its stability and customizability so these are the um, applications of this uh, operating system software and the examples are Microsoft Windows, Mac OS, Linux, Android, iOS, etc. And uh, next type of uh, computer software is the application software. First, we are seeing the general types. Then we dive uh, deeply into the uh, other uh, specific types of software. First, uh, the application software serves specific purposes for end users such as productivity, entertainment, communication and more. The examples are Microsoft Office Suite that includes Word, Excel, PowerPoint, Photoshop um, and uh, uh, Adobe Photoshop, Spotify, Zoom, etc. We can say in a, uh, numerous uh, application software and the applications are the Microsoft Office Suite aids in document creation and management while Spotify offers a music streaming. So uh, these are the areas in which this application softwares are used and uh, next is the utility software. This is a specific type that is it and enhances the computer's performance security and management by performing maintenance tasks. Examples or antivirus software like Norton, uh, disk cleanup, uh, backup software, etc. And the applications are antivirus software protects the systems from malware while backup uh, software ensures data uh, preservation. And this is about the utility software and next is the programming software and this assists in developers in creating debugging and managing code this uh, this assists the uh, programmers and who writes the program and uh, uh, examples or integrated development environments that is like uh, visual studio and eclipse and uh, applications of this IDs provide a comprehensive environment for writing, testing, and debugging the code. So this type of software is meant for this uh, programmers. And next is the system software. That is the system software. Uh, the, it is the general type of software that uh, bridges the gap between uh, hardware and applications facilitating communication and operation. This examples are device drivers firmware. This uh, device drivers enable hardware components to communicate with the OS ensuring proper functionality. So these device drivers firmware are uh, the examples of the system software that uh, enables communication with the operating system. And next is the embedded software. This is designed for specific hardware and often performs uh, dedicated functions. That is the firmware in uh, Internet of Things devices and car engine control system. And the applications are uh, here are the, this embedded uh, software powers um, smart devices and controls critical systems like engines. 
next is the open source software this is developed collaboratively and its source code is uh, accessible to the public uh, fostering that is uh, uh, community driven innovation the examples here are linux kernel uh, mozilla firefox and LibreOffice. and this promotes transparency and allows customization making it valuable for various applications Next is the proprietary software. This is developed and owned by companies often requiring licenses for use. And the examples are Microsoft Windows, Adobe uh, Creative Suite. And the uh, proprietary software is widely used for business applications, design and multimedia editing. And the uh, freeware, uh, this is a uh, software available for free but might not grant users full rights over the source code. Examples of cleaner, avas, uh, free antivirus. And this offers basic functionality without a financial cost. And next is the uh, last one is the shareware. And that is, this is uh, typically distributed for free initially, but requires payment for advanced features or continued use. Uh, for example, uh, WinZip and WinRap. And this allows users to try the software before committing to purchase. So, subscribe to my channel if you feel contented. Like and share my videos with your friends.